morning everybody I am on my way to a dealership to hopefully be dropping off the van to get that sliding glass door window fixed when we originally bought the van two weeks ago we never actually shut the sliding glass door so when we pulled up it was all beautiful with the bow the glass door you know the sliding doors open so we're like oh you know we checked everything we knew to check but it didn't occur to us to shut that door had we shut that door we would have noticed that the glass shakes when you shut the door we didn't really notice it until the next day when we were uh, putting stuff in and out of the van I was like oh goodness that door shakes what is that and so Bob inspected it and realized that the window is not fully sealed to the door like there is a gap you can literally peek in the top of the sliding glass door window and see inside our van and so it's not fully sealed we did not catch that when we were doing our walkthrough which is a bummer because then we called the La Mesa dealership or yeah the La Mesa uh, RV dealership and they said oh that's an exterior like ram promaster issue not a like rv inside issue so we don't cover it it's not under your warranty with that one with that warranty that they give so i'm like crap so we were like okay who do we call they said call a dealership so we called a dealership it's been almost two weeks we have an appointment we're going there hopefully they can fix it they didn't seem like they fix glass so i don't know and i'm just hoping that it's covered under warranty, right? It should be. I mean, like, we just bought this darn thing. So anyways, there's your update. I'm on my way. I'll keep you guys posted. Okay, I'm at the dealership. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So here's the window we have the issue with. What's going on? Let me see if I can peel this off. This I don't know if you can see, but this window is not connected to here. The glue from about right here to right there is not connected. So I don't want to take all of this off because until it gets fixed. Okay, bad news. I'm already back in the van. They could not help us. They said the sliding glass door is a custom piece. I have to say it was great customer service. He gave me his uh, direct line and their window person, but they said La Mesa RV definitely needs to cover that because it's a custom window on this van. The other windows they would have covered, but not the sliding glass door. So I have to call La Mesa RV and give them that information and hopefully they can help us because like you guys saw that needs to be fixed and the reason why bob's not with me is he's at work today so i am doing this on my own no no big deal but uh, it just feels like we get the runaround even though i do feel like they you know gave me the best information they could and and that's all that they could do for me but let's see what la mesa says well, I thought about it and I realized that I think the best move is for me to just drive to La Mesa RV right now and see if they'll look at the window and give them the number of the guy I just talked to and see if I can get it taken care of. Can't promise anything. Don't know if they'll even listen to me or they'll talk to me, but I'm going to go try because I'd like to just show them the window. Maybe they don't understand what we're talking about. I'm almost at the dealership La Mesa RV and Mesa Arizona dealership I'm just hoping I get to talk to somebody in the service center and I can show them what we're talking about and give them the number of that uh the Ram dealership or the Dodge Ram Dodge Dodge Ram dealership and hopefully they can talk together and somebody can come up with a plan because we need this fixed <laughs> All right, update, I just got in. I talked to a service center person. They pulled up all of our information. I explained the whole situation. I told them how, you know, I had a number for them to call if they needed to. They didn't need to call that number, they said. They brought a maintenance person up, came to our van, took pictures of the problem, said, 
they're gonna figure it out. They're gonna tell us where to go, what to do. Hopefully it's just their glass person and get it taken care of. <sighs> I hope so. It was good service. So far, good service. <laughs> I'm trying to keep a positive attitude in this. And yeah, so we'll see what happens next. So update time, it has been two weeks since that last shot of me um, leaving La Mesa RV thinking we're good, everything's great, this is going to get taken care of. It's been two weeks and yeah, um, it's, it wasn't good, it wasn't great, it's been two weeks, it's still not fixed. So I've, I've taken the last two weeks and actually the last month. Um, <laughs> calling La Mesa RV, calling Ram, playing phone tag with people, calling back and forth. Um, Hillary actually took it down there, as you guys know. Some more phone calls after that, and we still don't have it resolved, but we at least have an appointment with a glass person to remove the existing glass, basically re-glue it, and put it all back in. So, But... It, but... But... Literally, we we're taking it back to the start, back where I went the first time, and they told me this is not the place you have to take it back to La Mesa RV. No. Yeah. And the bummer of it is, you know, thankfully we live in Arizona, but we can't wash it. We haven't been able to use it. So we've been delaying videos and a bunch of other things for you guys that have been just really disappointing that we haven't been able to enjoy this van as much as we've wanted to. But. We do have a lot of good content, some great ideas coming. We just need to get this thing fixed so we can hit the road. So we've got another 10 days until we get it fixed. That's June 20th, and we're looking forward to finally having it done. Yeah, hopefully. 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 But we are going to go ahead and film the van tour with it not fixed. So that is coming next. That should be out this next week. So look for that. The van tour is still coming but yeah, we can't really take any trips because condensation can get in if we go anywhere else that is not as dry as Arizona. But we do have some fun stuff planned, like Bob said. So that's our latest update. I'm curious if you guys have ever had any issues like this before. This has never happened to me where I've had a window actually come unglued at, you know, like a factory gluing. But let me know. Have you guys ever seen something like this before? I think that's all we have for today. Thanks for coming along on this journey with us. Sorry that the end of this video didn't have it all done and fixed, but like always, we'll keep you posted. And until next time. Bye guys. Bye guys. <laughs> <laughs>